Hello and welcome to this video and to a home vlog this weekend. Um, so Pete, Jeff and I have just been for a walk to the woods and uh, it's a little muddy so we're, oh, let's forget about that. Uh, so we're seeing how the outside tap works. Oh and the floor's wet and I've got no shoes on. Got no shoes on. Um, so I'm just bringing a towel, getting wet feet. Um, how's the outside tap doing? Uh, he doesn't really like it. Why would he? It's cold. Well, it actually makes it like fairly, makes it easier. Yeah. Okay. It's still a bit dirty on the back. It's hard to get like the backs of it and stuff. And Thanks, Jeff. This tap is. Yep. Come here, Jeff. Um, but yeah, the, uh, the daffodils survived the snow. If you saw that video, if not, I'll link it up above. But they survived, they're coming out, it's pretty. And this is our garden, by the way. I don't think you've come out here. Because, you know, we moved in in winter, so. Really do need to get a pair of cheap slip on shoes to come out in the garden. And what? A cheap pair of slip on shoes. You can't miss because my trainers were dirty, so I don't want to trace them all the way through the house. So today we've got lots of sorting to do. We've got a few rooms that we need to sort out. I will show you as we go. Um, but first, I need to give a dog some breakfast. You know I mean business today because the hair is up in a ponytail. We're in just a t-shirt and jogging bottoms. And we're going to get things sorted. We currently don't have a mirror in our bedroom, which is a problem because how oh, it was a bit difficult to do my hair. But we do have this thing, so we will need to get that up today. Um, but I'll show you when we get round to that one. Um, my first job, unsurprisingly, is in the dining room because it has become a bit of our sort of dumping ground. As you know, we ended up having this as an endpoint storage unit. Most of the boxes have gone. So I want to get this stuff in the car, out of the way. We need to sort out some of these and get some of this up in the loft. And then we can use, because we borrowed the, the Vax carpet cleaner there from my mum and dad. And this is the only carpet we haven't done. And we need to give that back next week, week after, something like that. So it'd be good to get this carpet done today. And then that's done. And then we can start thinking about colors, a bigger dining table, that kind of stuff. So that's my first job because one of these boxes came from my parents' house. Um, we went through most of it, um, but there's a couple of bits that I need to sort out that I didn't have the mental space to do when we were doing it the other day. The other day was like a good month ago because we'd also sorted out a lot of other things. So I'm gonna get and sort out this box, which is mainly Cherished teddies and pictures and stuff that used to be in my bedroom as a child. Hey Jovi, did you enjoy your walk? Less so your hose down, but yeah, let's get on with this. So this is what I mean when I say cherished teddies. I used to get one every Christmas from my mum and dad. So I've got quite the collection. There's also some in the lounge already, so I'm going to have a look, play around. But these are all going to go, I think, in the garage. I'll show you in a minute. Um, I think some of these... This one's going to come, this is not a church teddy, but this is a glass thing from Walt Disney World. Um, I've had for years, I think I'm going to put that on the bookcase. And then I might put these little ones on the bookcase as well, or change some of the ones from, well it's in the lounge kind of thing. But these are definitely going up. There's a lot of them that have little dogs and stuff on, which is cool. Um, that's probably the closest to Jeff that I have. Um, yeah, it's probably the closest to you. Um, but yes, yeah, so I'm going to go and put them away and then we can see what them. I also have a whole Snow White scene here though. So I've got Snow White Teddy, Prince Charming Teddy, Evil Queen and the Seven Dwarves, which is pretty cool. In my opinion anyway, excuse the dog. So these are the ones that are currently on the shelf. Um, but I think I'm going to remove some of them or change some of them. Maybe not, maybe I could leave it as it is. 
I like, this is my um, wedding bouquet and we made these, as you saw, I think I put a video of that up. They were the jars that are on our tables um, and then I like the teddy with the rainbow next to it. Mm, I think I'm going to leave that as, as is. So I'll go and show you what I've done. If you can hear the washing machine, it is a Saturday, so needs must. Um, but as you can see, Pete's got these ones with some of his bits in. So I've decided to take this one and put my teddies in it. Um, so there they are. I think they have lights above them. I don't think that's going to make much difference to it, but there we go. That's where they're going to live for the time being anyway. And I'm happy with that. So I've come through the box of teddies and things like that. I've also sorted out the wedding suitcase as much as I can. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with some of the stuff. But the main thing is to get the Thompson sign on the wall. I mean, eventually this whole room will be painted and we'll change it around. But I want that there so I can get photos around it. My endless collection of baskets is coming in useful. So I've put our light bulbs in that and uh, Pete's not really on board with today's yeah. get things on. Yeah. Get things I'm done. just having a good it's, it's taken him till about quarter past one to be like I'm on it but no, it's a bit stuff day. I'll try to see one get out of the way sort of the rubbish still need to Take be on it though to, still need to be on it though so. Yeah, let's keep that picking up. Do you have a code? Endpoint. Is that it? Yeah. Just endpoint? Yeah. Well, okay. If I remember, I'll put a link to the website in my description. And then if you want a Beyond, which is a, a something drink that I don't know how to explain. Nootropic. Nootropic. Caffeine. Does that mean it's supposed to be good for like energy levels? Uh, yes. Oh, yeah. Mental stimulation as well. Okay. Uh, but anyway, yeah. End point if you want 10% off. But, but I'm helping you, Pete. I'm working for end point. <laughs> <laughs> Big day. No scary mannequins left in the room. They're gone. Woo! In the car. Yay. They need to be out the car by Friday, by the way. Yeah. Well, I should be out yeah, Monday. Just so you know. We're, we're travelling, we need the space in the car. It's only taken five months since we moved in, but we have a clear dining room. Bar, that one box. We're just going back to my mum and dad, so that's fine. That'll be gone next week. So yeah, we can now start thinking about how we want to decorate and what we want in it and a table and things like that. And stop eating dinner on our laps. So that'll be good. So obviously, eventually there'll be a dining room makeover video for you. But that is one job ticked off. We're getting there. Did yeah. some stuff. We have an empty dining room. Yeah. We no longer have boxes in the garage. We're clean under the stairs. Mannequins are gone. The mannequins are gone. That's, that's a big win for this weekend. Like, I've been waiting for that for ages. Put me koalas on my boomerang. Right. As I said to you earlier, we're going to go try and get this mirror in our bedroom. See how Actually, that goes. In the offices, we've got these mirrors in the back of um, doors. They're only like this big. And it's, it's generally just a full mirror because you can see that you see yourself like that far away. So I was wondering whether we should just go on that big. Well, you didn't say that when we were ordering. I only, found, I only saw this yesterday. So. Well, we'll see how this goes and then we can. It cost us £7, so. Yeah. See what we can do. Come on, family, up we go. Saying that, they might have been screwed on. Screwed on. They might be screwed on. Yes, yeah, this is the thing. Yeah. You're gonna shut the door because you're Pete. So we've got the what? What we're named. blood lawn. The blood lawn. And Apologies to every Swedish person out there for that pronunciation. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we're gonna try and get it on to the wardrobe here, um, which is why I don't want it screwed in because I don't think that'd be very good for the wardrobe. This is supposed to be a stick-on mirror in the four squares. Hello Jeff. Um, so we'll see what happens. 
Who's that, dear? You, mate. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Never bring a dog to do flat pack stuff. He's helping break it down. Break it down. Um, yeah, pig's close. Um, but this, is, this is why Jeff's good at getting into IKEA boxes, but he's not so helpful once you've done that. Are you, Jeff? Jeff. Jeff. Done. Easy. I'm always going to have a slight line in my forehead, although on the camera, I don't. So, strange. Because I certainly do there, but I don't on the camera. If you lift up slightly to your eyes, that, that length, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I guess. That's where your eyes actually are, so you need to kneel down a little bit. So I need to do that. <laughs> What is this perspective lark? But yeah, easy. Sticky, sticky, done. That'll make life easier for us. Well done, Pete. Well done, Jeff. Grabbed a cardi because I was feeling a little bit chilly. But I've come into the guest room because last weekend when I was in London seeing all of those shows, um, if you haven't seen that video, I'll link it up above for you. Pete was building a bookshelf for me. So these are just the Billy bookshelves from Ikea, obviously, because they wouldn't be anything else. But we had this alcove, as you know, that we were, or I would like, I wanted bookshelves in. We thought about going all the way around, but then thought that'd make, make it a bit enclosed, and we also couldn't work out how that would work. Um, but we found a sort of curved Billy, so they're the sort of three little ones, and then a normal Billy there. So we've got all of these shelf space to play with, and I'm thinking, not straight away, but normally you have quite a lot of gap um, at the tops of these things, so you could probably fit another shelf, and you can buy extra shelves for the Billy bookcases. Um, so I'm going to see how it goes. I think I'm going to go that way rather than that way. And I'm going to start with hardbacks and then paperbacks. But always A to Z on author's last name. So here are all the books that I had in our London flat that I'm going to get on the bookshelves and I'm going to sort it all out. And then I can let my mum and dad know that they can start bringing my books from my childhood bedrooms because I moved around a lot. But there's still a lot of books to come and we'll see where we go. I doubt I'll be keeping all of them. But I kind of need to reread them to know what I want. But yes, yeah, so that's what I'm going to do next. I'm going to make piles of books, put them on shelves, and I'm very excited about it. So yeah, that's going to be my, the rest of my afternoon, probably. So I'll try and time lapse or do something to make it fun. But yeah, first I'm going to pile it. So I'll come back to you once I've done that. So this is all my and Pete's books, to be fair all in alphabetical order and then this is sort of the hardback miscellaneous pile so now we need to get these up there so i've got to work out the order that the Millie Johnson books were published in because that'll annoy me if it's not in order and I have all of them, or almost all of them, so this will take a while. So let's get back to the music. <laughs> I said there's more books coming but I've done the ones I have there's still like the odd gap here and there but I'm, I'm pretty happy with how it's coming along and there's still place space for me to grow and like quite a lot of space for me to grow so here we go so as I said I've gone from left to right so we start with the hardbacks and then we go to paper books um, so there you go uh, this is just sort of random books that we have. I don't really know where to put them. And then this is my TBR. 
but I know when I put in the books that I've just read I'm gonna have to shift that but that's fine for now and yeah I've put a few little decorations up so that teddy bear is bride teddy bear that someone made me for our wedding um, obviously I said there are a couple of cherished teddies so I've put them there along with my Mickey and Minnie and then these little things um, my brother made me when we went to see some of the shows so I've got Matilda on that side and then Pongo on that side so at the moment I'm happy with how that's looking it will evolve I'm sure but a good happy to have some books on a bookshelf and it just looks so much better and I'm very very happy so yeah now I really want to like reread half of the ones on the shelf and I'm sure there are ones on here that I can unhaul and get rid of um, I do have a little pile going down there of ones that I can do that for so yeah good job sometime later but I have just been making thumbnails for a couple of videos I finished our wedding photo book so when that arrives I'll show you that one and we're just taking Jeff for a walk um, so I'm still doing the to-do list don't know if you can see that but we did pretty well today and what we need to do there's not a huge amounts for tomorrow um, so um, we actually got through a lot more than I thought we would today but we're now going to have some pasta bake chill for the evening and I'll come back to you tomorrow probably still in this t-shirt let's be honest um, but I'll see you tomorrow good morning welcome back it's now Sunday that noise you can hear is Jeff eating his breakfast uh, I'm in the kitchen I have this on trying to keep my hair out of the way a bit because I'm going to bake cake or a no bake cake thing at the bob um, so that's the first plan for this morning. So we're making a no-bake chocolate fudge cake. I may have made this on the channel before. If I have, I'll link it up above, but I can't remember. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna whack some music on, make this, and then we'll see where the day takes us. I wish I had a food processor, because crushing those biscuits, that took ages. And they're not that crushed, but I can't be bothered anymore. So the headband gave me a headache, but that's another thing. Ticked off the to-do list because the cake is in the fridge cooling. We can eat that later. Somebody's appeared. Hello there. buddy. The uh, clock's changed, so Pete decided that that meant 11 o'clock. Yes and no. I'm going to sort out the dishwasher, then turn up the music and go and clean the house. Fun times! So, we are several hours later from when I made the cake. I think you can still call it cake, even if it's in the fridge. Um, and <coughs> we have now cleaned the whole house. I was going to call it a flat then. We don't live in a flat anymore. That's, uh, that's odd. And we have... To sorted everything out, we used the, the vax thing on the carpets, that's all done. We're doing very well with this to-do list. Um, I've just filmed my book review. Apologies, I did say it in that video. But apologies if you have seen it and it's all over the shop. People kept in Things kept interrupting me, and so I'm hoping it does make sense when I go to edit it in a minute or a bit later. But I'm obviously sad back here in front of the bookshelf. I didn't actually film in front of it this time because, you know, this video hasn't come out yet so you don't know about it. And i am obviously got these books to put into it and I've realised that I made a bit of a mistake, didn't I? I made a boo-boo and put in the, those TBR books there because I'm now going to have to move them all because I've got five books to try and get in my shelves. So that's what I'm up to now and then the reason Pete rang is because he needs help finding some seats for a theatre show. So I'm going to go and help him with that. So we've done pretty well. We have wrap presents left. 
Oh, I just washed my hair, so now I'm dripping on everything. Um, oh, it's been my mum and dad's birthday. I'm seeing them next week. I needed to wrap the presents. Pete's got some to do as well. But that's an easy job to do during the week. The book review that I filmed and edited, I haven't uploaded it, but again, I can do that tomorrow. And then we technically have done some of the photo books because we ordered our wedding one and finished that off. But it would have been nice to make a start on the year or the honeymoon. But that's not time sensitive, so that's fine. So all in all, I think we've done a pretty good job with the uh, to-do list this week, which is uh, a welcome change. We normally have a lot more left over um, when we're doing that kind of thing. Um, but now we're going to have some dinner, watch some TV and chill. I'll probably start my book tonight. If you saw the book review, you'll know which one I'm talking about. Um, just on that note, if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, oh, I blend in. If you haven't already, please go ahead and subscribe. We've got more stuff coming up. I can't remember what's coming up, but things are planned. So that's all on its way, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.